Yep. So your cyanide kit, you'll pull from its socket your main, and it comes in this kit. Should come with a two-ended spike, and then your bottle will actually be in this smaller box so that you can hang it afterward. But when you go to mix it, you will want to rotate until you can see where this fill line is. So the dilution requires sodium chloride and it's 200 mils is the volume. If you don't have NS available, you can use LR or D5, uh, but sodium chloride is what the manufacturer recommends. And we have 250 mil bags of NS down here. So if using one of these, you will take your spike and then spike your fluid and then spike the bottle. And then I'll usually, to help get it in faster, just squeeze the bag and watch the fluid level until I hit that fill line. Since this is a 250 mil bag, alternatively, you can grab two 100 mil bags if you don't want to have to pay attention to the fill line or you can't see it. So if you have access to 200 mil bags, that may be faster. And then after that, you'll want to just gently rock or invert it for at least 60 seconds. Uh, you do not want to shake it. And then once it's all diluted, you'll use the provided tubing for adults because then it'll just run by gravity for 15 minutes. In children, since it's an actual 70 meg per kilo dose, it'll be a specific volume. When you dilute it with 200 ml, your final concentration should be 25 mg per ml. And in that case, I would grab the vented Alaris tubing and then put it on the pump and do a manual infusion for the desired volume to get your dose. Over 15 minutes? Mm -hmm. Okay. And that I think is about Thank you. It. Yeah.